to my Windex Tourette's. My name is Ella Hikana, but you can call me Ati Ella, and I'm your tour guide for today. Beside me is our coach captain, Sir Kevin. Sir Kevin is a licensed and professional driver for more than 10 years, and he will make sure that we will have a safe and a happy trip. So, in behalf of Tartar's Travel and Tour, I would like to welcome you all and the second class component city and the province of Negros Occidental. Welcome to Cadiz City. The city is a major sugar cone producing area. This is transported to Victoria City for further refining. Another major source of livelihood in the city is the harvest of seafoods. Before we proceed to our first destination, let me tell you a few reminders. First, Put your trash on a proper trash bin or might as well put it in your bag. Second, don't leave your things unattended to avoid unnecessary loss. Third, observe body-body system. It means you have to be with someone wherever you go for your safety. And fourth, don't forget our bus number which is bus number 4. And lastly, always remember the golden rules of traveling. Take nothing but pictures, leave nothing but footprints, kill nothing but time. And also, don't forget to wear your beautiful smiles. Let me see your beautiful smiles, Teres. Perfect! Our first destination is the home of 28 species of butterfly, the Balay Alibangbang. Balay Alibangbang is a Hiligayan word for the house of butterfly. Balay Alibangbang is a 5 hectares wide located in a shelter tank of Barangay Lunep, Cadiz City. The property offers children playground, swimming pool, cottages and function halls, museum of mini meters where you can see a lot of collection of different species of butterflies, souvenir items, and a lot more. And also, they have the butterfly dome where you can see the 28 species of beautiful butterflies. Okay, tourists, take your time to look around the place, take some pictures, and buy some souvenirs if you want. But if you see me raising this flag, it means that your time is up and we need to go to our next destination. Okay, tourists, your time is up. We need to go to your second destination. But before we proceed, how's your first destination? Amazing, did you see the 28 species of butterfly? Wow! Welcome to our second destination, the Santa Nina Paris Church. Cadizanians were happy for having this Santa Nina. They believe in the good fortune and mystery that he carries. People of Cadiz proclaim him as their patron saint and protector. Popular stories have it that after Kabakob brought home the image of Child of Jesus in the Cadiz city, more pirates were failed in their attempt in disembarking the shore of Cadiz. The image of Santa Nino, a shrine at the altar of Cadiz City Paris Church, Cadizanians believe that with the guidance and blessings of this patron protector, they will ultimately attain the social and economic prosperity that they've been dreaming of. Okay, tourists, it is your time to look around, take some photos, buy some souvenirs if you want, and pray at the patron saint of Cadiz City. Okay, tourists, your time is up. We need to go to your next destination. So after 30 minutes bus ride and 20 minutes boat ride, we're here in the sunny island of Lakawan. Lakawan Island is a 13 hectares banana shaped island in the Cadiz northern portion of the province of Negros Occidental. The term Lakawan is derived from the Cebuano word Lakao, means to walk. The island have got its name because during low tide, one has to literally walk from the main island. So tourists, this is your most awaited time, your free time to enjoy the island. But before that, let me tell you the water activity of the island. First, they have the kayaking, banana boat, bandwagon, UFO, mermaid tail, beach volleyball, paddleboard, and snorkeling. But you must be here in our starting point by 3 because we will going to proceed in the Tahai floating bar. And now we're here in a unique service that Lakawan Island Resort has and other beach resort that don't as the Taohai Floating Bar. Taohai Floating Bar is also known as Lakawan Floating Bar. It's just a couple of minutes away from the Lakawan Island and it's only accessible by a boat. Lakawan Floating Bar is the biggest floating bar in Asia where many enjoy in the spectacular view of the beach. 
So Torres, how is your experience in the island? Great, I'm happy to hear that. But sad to say that this is the end of our tour. So in behalf of Tortoise Travel and Tour, our coach, Captain, and myself saying, good things come and go, but memories last forever. Once again, my name is Ella Hikana, your tour guide for today. Thank you for choosing Tortoise Travel and Tour. Till next time, mabuhay and God bless.